In 2012, the Misericordia women's soccer team reached the Division III Final Four, the deepest postseason run of any team in school history. Nine years later, Misericordia ranked number one in the country as the NCAA tournament is set to begin this weekend. Photojournalist Rich Charneski caught up with the Cougars at practice this week. Defensively yeah, work to keep them pinned in. Don't let them out. Channel it. Channel it. The number one ranking is awesome for the program. It's awesome for the alumni that helped build us to this point because I don't care how good of a year you have. If you haven't been there regularly in the top 10, you're not getting to number one. So we have to give the, the credit to the, the programs before us that have and those players before us that have helped us get to this point and make this possible. Don't let them close those spaces early. It's jammed intentionally. We've had a really great season so far, and I think just working together as a team and spending so much time together, we're all very close and know each other so well. So just the team aspect of our play is very, very, very good, and we play very unselfishly. I think everyone has their own strengths on the field that come together and help us win. Like, the backs do their job, midfield does their job, forwards do their job, but we all do it together. See, see it now, see it now! We don't give up a lot of goals, and you can't mark one player out of our match because we have so many players that are dangerous and can go to goal. I think just pushing ourselves individually and then as a whole, we all come together and able to just all contribute in our own special ways and work together as a team, and that's really helped our success. It's a pretty big deal, and we're super excited and to have other great teams and schools come here to play. It's, it's pretty neat. We have solid players all throughout. We have some kids giving quality minutes um, off our bench in the reserve role. And when you get that and, and the other team doesn't really have any piece that they can pick on um, during the match, it, it just really changes things. So, yeah, they, they stack up just like with the others. And uh, now it's just confidence building and uh, getting them to believe that they can do it in the tournament and hoping the ball bounces your way.